Today, we're here in the village of Katete at the home of Fortune. Every morning, Fortune wakes up before the sun rises and walks down to the village well to get fresh water. When he gets back, everyone is awake and waiting. He helps his mom by washing the dishes, collecting wood, and starting the fire for breakfast. Hey, what's that goat doing? Goats can't do dishes. Before he can eat, Fortune takes some of the fresh water and showers up. After breakfast, he puts on his school uniform and combs his hair. Looking sharp, Fortune. He says goodbye to his mother, and he's off. Fortune's school is in a neighboring village about an hour and a half away from his home. Luckily for Fortune, it never snows in Zambia. Every morning, Fortune and his friend Gary string up the Zambian flag and hoist it into the air. Fortune loves learning and plans to be a doctor someday. At lunchtime, Fortune rings the recess bell and all the kids gather around the school's well. After school, Fortune walks home and plays with the children from his village. One of their favorite games is soccer. But because most of them don't have the money to buy a real soccer ball, Fortune shows us how they use plastic bags and string to make their own. Not bad. Let's see how he does with a real soccer ball. Fortune? When Fortune was just a little boy, his mother was in an accident that paralyzed her from the waist down. She couldn't move her legs at all. Since their family didn't have the money, some members of the community put together a makeshift wheelchair. Fortune's mother enjoys sitting under the hut and weaves together string to make fishing nets. The money that she makes from the nets helps pay for Fortune's school and other necessities. Not long after the accident, Fortune decided he was going to help his mom put food on the table by catching fish. Every evening, he starts by digging up some worms. Yummy! Then he goes down to the river, picks a spot, and casts his line. Doesn't look like the fish are biting here. Maybe he'll have luck in another spot. This looks better. You caught one! Good job, Fortune! Back at home, Fortune boils a pot of inchima, stews up some vegetables, and fries up his fish. Delicious! Fortune's mother always prays to thank God for what they do have. One day, their neighbor surprised Fortune and his mother by scraping enough money together to buy her a brand new wheelchair. In the Bible, Book of Psalms, chapter 34, verse 18, it says, The Lord is close to the brokenhearted. Even though what happened to Fortune's mother was really sad, Fortune knows that when life is sad, God is good. <laughs>